We communicate with Ukrainians about their needs and what we can provide, starting with the president and ending with the staff. Pentagon spokesperson John F. Kirby stated this during a press conference on Monday. The conflict in Ukraine has demonstrated that artillery is still the most crucial weapon in combat. Long-range shooting is frequently used by both sides in the conflict to kill opponents and prevent them from winning. The US and NATO sent artillery after the Ukrainian military requested it. As part of its 90M7 program, the Pentagon is also delivering seven 155mm howitzers to Ukraine. More of the same kind of howitzers are being sent by both Canada and Australia. Additionally, 12 pieces of self-propelled, 90,155mm armoured artillery will be sent by the UK. It has been decided to send 155mm Panzer Hobbit's 2000SP self-propelled howitzers from the Netherlands, Belgium, and Italy. 12 Caesar 155mm self-propelled howitzers from France will be deployed. The 155mm M-77-7 howitzer improved long-range fire capabilities for the Ukrainian army. But a lot of people believe that the potent M109 Paladin self-propelled howitzer, produced by Bay Systems, is the most crucial item the Ukrainian military requires. 30 feet in length and 27.5 tons in weight make up the M109 Paladin. Four people make up the crew. A commander, a pilot gunner, a munitions carrier, and a magazine. The M109 Paladin is the A6 version of this self-moving howitzer. The US military now employs more than 900 of these howitzers. The Meter Care Browning Howitzer is on top of the M109 Paladin, which is armed with a 4,155mm Meter Care 80 gun. Number 50 Heavy Machine Gun The M109 Paladins can fire up to 8 rounds per minute and can maintain a steady tempo of 3 minutes between each round. The self-propelled howitzer can fire its rounds from up to 15 km distance when using unaided cartridges. It can fire from a distance of around 30 km using aided cartridges.